Video number six, notices of motion. The majority leader. <coughs> Mr. Speaker, sir, I rise to give notice of the following motion, which is the establishment of a special committee to investigate the proposed removal from office by way of impeachment of His Excellency Rigadi Gashagwa, EGH, the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya. That were raised pursuant to standing to Article 151B and 2 and Article 145 of the Constitution and the National Assembly Standing Orders Number 64 and 65. On the 8th of October 2024, the National Assembly approved a special motion for the removal from office by impeachment of H.E. Regadi Gashagwa, EGH, Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya, and further were raised. By letter reference NADLP TBO MTS 2024 uh, 025, dated 8th of October 2024, and received in the office of the Speaker of the Senate on the 9th of October 2024. The Speaker of the National Assembly informed the Speaker of the Senate of the approval of the special motion by the National Assembly and further forwarded to the Speaker of the Senate documents in evidence of the proceedings of the National uh, Assembly. And whereas pursuant to Article 145.3b of the Constitution, as read together with Article 152 of the Constitution and Standing Orders, 78.1 and 79 of the Senate Standing Orders, the Senate may by resolution appoint a special committee comprising 11 of its members to investigate the matter. Now, therefore, pursuant to Article 145.3b, the Constitution of the Constitution as read together with Article 152 of the Constitution and the Standing Orders of the S Senate Standing uh, Orders. The Senate resolves to co constitute a special committee to investigate the proposal, proposed removal from office by impeachment of H.E. Rigadi Gashagwa, E.G.H., Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya. I thank you, Mr. Speaker. Next order. Order number eight, motion, establishment of a special committee to investigate the proposed removal from office by impeachment of His Excellency Rigadi Gachagua, EGH, the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya. Majority Leader. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, there's a motion on the, I beg to move the following motion, the establishment of a special committee to investigate the proposed removal from office by impeachment of H.E. Rigadi Gashagwa, E.G.H., Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya, that were raised pursuant to Article 151B and 2, Article 145 of the Constitution and the National Assembly Standing Orders uh, 64 and 65, on 8th of October 2024, the National Assembly approved a special motion for the removal from office by impeachment of His Excellency Rigadi Gashagwa, EGH, the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya. And further, whereas by letter reference NADLP, stock TBO, stock MTS, 2024, uh, uh, 025, dated 8th of October 2024, received in the office of the Speaker of the Senate on the 9th of October 2024, the Speaker of the National Assembly informed the Speaker of the Senate of the approval of the special motion by the National Assembly and further forwarded to the Speaker of the Senate documents in evidence of the proceedings of the National Assembly. And whereas pursuant to Article 145.3b of the Constitution, as read together with Article 152 of the Constitution and Standing Order 78.1 and 79 of the Senate Standing Orders, the Senate may, by resolution, appoint a special committee comprising of 11 of its members to investigate the matter. Now, therefore, pursuant to Article 145.3b of the Constitution, as read together with Article 152 of the Constitution uh, and Standing Order uh, 78.1 of the Senate Standing Orders, 
the Senate resolves to constitute a special committee to investigate the proposed removal from office by impeachment of His Excellency Rigadi Gashagwa, EGH, Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya. Mr. Speaker, this is uncharted territory. For the first time, the Senate of the Republic of Kenya is being invited uh, to conduct an impeachment hearing of uh, a deputy president. Uh, uh, much as this is constitutional, Mr. Speaker, it's the first time that this is happening. And uh, there is a proposal before us as a House, as per our standing orders, to either consider this matter, uh, we have two options as per our standing orders, to either consider this matter by a special committee or the plenary. Uh, the motion before us, Mr. Speaker, is a proposal to the House that we select 11 of our members from both sides of the House to consider this impeachment and uh, advise us, uh, Mr. Speaker. <laughs> Mr. Speaker, uh, I don't know what uh, is the excitement in the House. I have said already that uh, this has never happened before. But uh, that's the proposal uh, that should we, and I want to urge members to agree with me, that we elect 11 of our wisest and most trusted <laughs> senators, uh, Mr. Speaker, who we think have the sufficient wisdom uh, to read on our behalf, make a decision, and as you know, as power standing orders, Mr. Speaker, should they elect that the matters have not been substantiated, the matter dies, and there is no recourse for the House. However, should they uh, confirm any of the 11 charges, even one, uh, Mr. Speaker, then they will invite the rest of us uh, to join them in making a decision. Therefore, Mr. Speaker, with those very many remarks, uh, this is not a matter that uh, I want to speak long to because there's more serious uh, matters that lay ahead with regards to this particular motion, uh, Mr. Speaker. With those very many remarks, I want to invite the Senator for Nairobi, Senator Edwin Watenya Sifuna, to second this motion. I thank you, Honorable Speaker, as you have indicated in your communication. Indeed, this is a matter that is extremely...